Hi everyone, how are you? My name is Danny, and today I'm going to do a short lesson all about concrete nouns. Now what is a concrete noun? A concrete noun is something that interacts with one or more of our five senses at one time. So this is something we can taste, touch, hear, smell or see. So we know that there are many different concrete nouns because there are many things that we can see, hear, smell, touch and taste. It would be impossible to speak and not use concrete nouns when we talk. Um, and this is because we are always using our five senses. We are always going to encounter a number of concrete nouns throughout the day at any time. So how can we tell if something is a concrete noun? That's nice and easy because to help us figure it out, all we need to do is ask ourselves the following questions. And that's, can I see it? Can I smell it? Can I taste it? Can I touch it? And can I hear it? So right now, I'm sure you can tell me something that you can taste and something you can touch, something you can hear, something you can smell and something that you can see. So right now, I can see a tree. I can taste my coffee. I can touch my cat. What can I hear? I can hear the birds outside. What can I smell? I can smell my flowers. So below I have some really easy examples of concrete nouns for us to take a quick look of. So the first one that I have is cloud. I can see a cloud in the sky. So here the sense we are using is see, we're using our eyes to see the cloud, the cloud being the concrete noun. So what can you see? I can see a cloud in the sky. Our next one is flower. This flower smells really nice. So our sense is our smell with our nose and the concrete noun is the flower. So what can you smell? I can smell a flower. Does that flower smell nice? This flower smells really nice. Now of course just like before we can see and smell the flower so it can use two of our senses. My next one is chocolate. The taste of this chocolate is amazing. So again, our sense is taste. We are using our mouths. And the concrete noun is chocolate because we can taste it. So do you like the taste of your chocolate? The taste of this chocolate is amazing. And just like before, we can see chocolate, we can smell it, and we can taste it. So the next one that I have is desk. I can touch my desk. So the sense is touch. We do this with our hands and the concrete noun is desk because we are touching my desk. Um, so what can you touch? I can touch my desk. I can touch my pencil, my ruler, my notebook, all of these things I can touch. So like before, I can see my desk, I can touch my desk, but I wouldn't want to taste my desk. I don't think that would be very nice, do you? Now the last example I have is music. Can you hear that music? So the sense is here with our ears and the concrete noun is music. So can you hear that music? Yes, I can hear that music. Or no, I can't hear that music. So, music I can hear. A desk I can touch. 
Chocolate, I can taste. Flower, I can smell a flower. Clouds, I can see a cloud in the sky. So, just before we finish, I'm sure you can look all around you. I want you to think about something you can taste, something you can touch, something you can hear, something you can smell, and something that you can see. Because all of the things that you can taste, touch, hear, smell, and see are all concrete nouns. Now, I hope this clears it up a little bit better for you, and I hope you enjoyed listening. Take care, everybody. Speak to you soon.